Uncle Roger banned from China because of my stand-up show. China, good country, good country. Good country, good country. So today, Uncle Roger gonna make Chinese national dish, Peking duck. Hopefully, it's gonna be so good. Impress China and they let me back into their country. You need to impress me first. This is Samuel Lee, head chef at Shang Palace. The only Chinese restaurant in France with Michelin star. Uncle Roger need to learn picking duck skill from him. How to cook duck, how to serve duck to customer. And we all know Uncle Roger hate customer of all kind. I've been fired from so many jobs now. Hi, uh. But before we can even start making duck, we have to make sauce that go on duck. The crispy coating. For the crispy skin. If picking duck not crispy, you fucked up. Commercial kitchen, the stove you use your leg to turn on fire. Fuyo. Chef Samuel, do you like induction stove? <laughs> this is one. better. Cleaning the wok? Wok cannot clean with soap, you have to clean with water. Water, red vinegar, white vinegar. The whole thing? Vinegar is cheap, no problem, you can cook more. Why you use cheap vinegar in this expensive restaurant? This coating no need to use expensive vinegar. I uh, don't tell everyone, niece and nephew, Shang Palace, they cutting corner. Maltos. Maltos is sugar that come from wheat, very common in Chinese cooking, and it tastes delicious. Oh, mm. nice. Oh, good. This is like better version of honey. It's like honey on crack. We're gonna braise duck with this liquid, make it crispy, and give picking duck nice red color. How long you been chef now, Chef Samuel? More than 15 years. 15 years? How old are you? But you look so young. Look at this camera. Look at Chef Samuel. You got baby face. 15 years? But you look like 16 years old. <laughs> Do you start become chef when you were two? I uh... uh... Throw lemon in? Yes. Yes. Oh shit. <laughs> Try to look cool and I fucked up. Now the crispy coating ready. Ugh. Not good. This one not used to be drink. Not to be drink? Uncle Roger thing gonna taste like picking duck, but it tastes like vinegar. I uh... Okay, now we cup the duck. Caesar? Yes. Where your Chinese cleaver? Where? We have, uh, but this one more safe. Uncle Roger, don't need to be safe. I like to live dangerously. So, we uh, take off the wings, like this. Okay, you have so many kitchen workers. Why are you stuck doing this? We move the fat. Yes. Fuyo, nice. Mm. This duck fatter than my ex-wife. <laughs> Fuyo. Uncle Roger can do that. So easy. Close enough? Give the duck nice spa holiday. Fuyo. Is that correct? Yeah, correct. Duck starting to cook now, see? It's all pink. Uncle Roger, I'm tired. Uncle Roger, tired. I'm too old. How are you so strong? So. Yo. See how pro he is? Now the crispy coating, go back in. And now we do it again? Yes, do it again. I, uh, picking up so much work. Please and nephew, Uncle Roger regretting this. I think just go to Panda Express, eat orange chicken. Keep the duck in the fridge uh, 24 hours for the drying. That's why when you order picking duck at restaurant, they always ask to give 24 hour notice. Because we need to keep the skin is drying. If the skin not dry? Not crispy. Ah. Ah. He's a nephew. You see the outside Shangri-La Hotel? So pretty. But look at this shit. You don't see the ugly part they hide from you. The duck gonna get lonely. Chef Samuel, you know when we walk past Chef in kitchen, we have to say behind. Yeah. What you say here? Tai Chi, Tai Chi. Oh, Tai Chi. Oh, Cantonese. Yeah. Nice, nice. I'm going to prefer that. Duck in fridge after 24 hours, it look like this. Feels so nice, nice and dry. 
and smooth also. Why the duck skin nicer than your skin? You need more skincare, Chef Samuel. Camera close up, zoom in on his face. Show off the pimple, show off the scarring. For now, we take out the feather. Hiya, how many times we need to do this? There's no machine to do this automatically. Uncle Roger feel like working at beauty salon. Just serve feather to your customer. Who give a shit? Just uh, keep moving. Oh no, no, hi. Uh, Uncle Roger fucked up. Wait, Chef Samuel, this is Arwen. What? This looks like some Elon Musk spaceship thing camera. Look, this is where I hide all the dead body. How long we put in there? 45 minutes. That'll be nice and crispy when it come out. Yes. Fuyo, look how nice this look. Ah, uh, Chef Samuel, see? Our duck both look the same. 15 year experience. 15 minute experience. Look the same. Oh, these are our customer. How are you guys doing? You good? Great. Five day, five day, five day, five day lah. Your, your glove, your glove bad quality. Oh, no? You are so big. Yeah, you know what they say? Big, big finger, you know? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> then you cut in the middle. Cut the whole way? See all the lady impressed, you know? Look how impressed she is. Totally impressed. How you say Uncle Roger in French? Uncle Roger. Ooh. <laughs> are you guys both French? Yes. Okay, French yeah. food so easy. French onion soup. Really? You just yeah. put in pot, that all you do? Uh -huh. Chinese food better than French food? Um, not sure, not sure. No? Different. You think French food better than Chinese food? <laughs> Why are they customer here? <laughs> <laughs> go back and eat your crepe, ratatouille, <laughs> coca one. go eat your snail, your escargot, uh -huh. go eat that. You don't deserve picking duck. One, two, three, and four. Don't tell his manager, you're gonna get fired. Okay, we won't. One, two, three, and four, where? Here? Four, just follow, yeah. Follow? Yeah. Don't just say f follow what? So you just pick the skin out? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Oh, nice. Nice, and what? And then you put on the... No, I'm going to try first. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> You have to taste test before you serve? No? <laughs> no, because I know it's very good. Oh, so confident. <laughs> and how is yours? It's good, it's good. Okay. You're gonna like I it. See when I eventually <laughs> serve to you, you're gonna like it. Okay. <laughs> He's just eating now. Mm, <laughs> so good. Sometimes people eat the skin with uh, sugar, you know? Why you don't do sugar? Because we have a uh, very delicious sauce. Uh, hoisin sauce with uh, some garlic, uh, honey. We mix together, make our own secret sauce. You're doing great. Thank you. <laughs> Do French people eat duck? Yes, sure. You put duck, you cook duck? Yeah. You just put garlic and cheese on it. That's all you do. <laughs> and onions cheese. everywhere. And onion, yeah. Cheese everywhere. Cheese <laughs> and butter. You guys all gonna get cholesterol and die, you know? <laughs> That's the basics. Hey, not bad, see? Yeah, not bad. Camera, camera, close up. When I do good, you have to catch. <laughs> Don't only catch when I fuck up, you know? <laughs> have you seen salt bay cutting? You do. Yeah, and you need to hump the table. <laughs> he cut like this. See? Ah, nice. Is that how he met his wife, you know? <laughs> oh, really? Mm. Oh, it's good? Uh, I'm good, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> We're almost ready, we almost ready. What are you in a hurry for? It's Friday. In France, nobody work anyway. Oh, you know? No, really? Yeah, you guys work, what, two hours a day? Two hours a day, you know? oh, okay. You can't send email after 6 p.m., is that true? <laughs> Not true. Oh. 
Tata. I hear some Chinese chefs spent their whole lifetime trying to learn how to carve this. Yes. Yeah, I can see why now. It's very difficult. For you? What? Have you tried before? Carving this? Never. You want to try? You cut here. Yeah. Yeah, and take the skin out. Yes. Like this? Yeah. Oh, you just tearing. New technique also. Ta -da. See? Ta -da. Oh, <laughs> eat, eat. Eat. Put okay. it in your mouth. Uh -huh. She actually did good job. <laughs> You can get a job here at Shang Palace, you oh, know? Oh, really? Yeah. You're hiring me, chef? Yes, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they need some diversity in there. It all Chinese people. Ah. Need some diversity. <laughs> diversity. Diversity. What is diversity? Diversity. 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 That's how French people sound. <laughs> <laughs> See, I make your customers so happy. They laughing, slightly uncomfortable, but a laugh is still a laugh. Oh. When you die, you just put the knife in there, is that? No. <laughs> no. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, the, the sharp place is up here. No dangerous. No dangerous. <laughs> Hospital very close. Don't worry. <laughs> a bit of showmanship in your kitchen. Mm. Shang Palace, second Michelin star coming soon. Stop to eating. Mm. We need to shift to the test them. Oh, I forgot about yes, them. Please. Sorry, sorry, here sorry. Here we are. Mm. <laughs> wow. So here is our Shang Palace picking duck. Wow. And here Thank is Uncle you. Roger picking duck. Mm. Wow. Kind of flat, right? <laughs> kind of flat? You kind of flat, that who flat? Hi. Uh, Ah, this this pancake so thin, look like foreskin, you know? <laughs> Do you have that in France? <laughs> yeah, we yeah. Oh, no, no. It's delicious. You haven't even eaten it yet. <laughs> not bad, not bad. It look a bit ugly, but it tastes good. If I close my arms, it's perfect. Mmm, good, good. That's what all women tell Uncle Roger also. <laughs> if I close my eye, you're perfect. <laughs> so what you think? What you think? I think both are great, but I prefer the chef's one. <laughs> They're saying that because you work here. They feel bad for you, you know? <laughs> no, the customer is very uh, honest. <laughs> fine, fine. Here's a nephew. Don't try to make picking duck at home. It takes so long. You have to plant it, you have to freeze it, you have to shower it. Then you have to serve it to ungrateful customer. <laughs> Chef Samuel, do you think my duck good enough for China to unban Uncle Roger? You need to continue uh, work more. Come to Shang Palace, best Chinese restaurant in Paris. Yeah, we recommend the picking duck. We have a different cooking way to provide to you. Have a soup, have a wok fry with the salad. Come meet Chef Samuel. Bye bye. Bye bye. Ready? <laughs> okay. So today, Uncle Roger is going to make Chinese national dish, Peking duck. Hopefully, it's going to be so good, impress China, and they let me back into their country. You need to impress me first, and then I teach you how to cook it. Chef to the guests. Oh no, hopefully Uncle Roger won't get him fired. Uh, one more try, one more try. Hiya. Uh... Oh! Now we put in oven. How we do this? We hold like this. Oh, yo, like Wolverine. Nice. Okay. We hold like this. 